In this video, we'll be covering how to set up rooms within FlowHub. Let's get started. Let's select the silhouette at the bottom left of the page. This is going to bring up some options. We want to select Manage. This will bring up two options, Location Management and Company Management. The difference between these two is that Company Management is going to host the umbrella data or parent data for the location. Location is going to be specific to the dispensary location that we are currently building out. We'll get to company management shortly, but let's select location management for now. As you can see, our landing section for location management is rooms. The purpose of creating rooms is to host and manage your inventory. To add a room, select the addition symbol at the top right of the section. This brings up our add new room window. Let's add the room that will host your for sale inventory. We can refer to this as sales room, dispensary floor, or for sale room. The description field is optional for further transparency. Once we select save, we'll see this populate on the page. Let's do this again and add a room that is gonna host our not for sale inventory. We can call this room back stock, vault, or back of the house. Again, the description field is optional for further transparency. Our best practice is to have one room that hosts for sale inventory and one room that hosts not for sale inventory. We're adding inventory to your flow hub. We'll have the option as to which room to add the inventory to. We can also move inventory from our not for sale room into our for sale room. This gives us full control over our inventory. In summary, we've selected the addition symbol at the top right of the page, named our room, added an optional description for the room, and determined whether it was for sale or not for sale. Once you've completed this step, update this task status to done. If you need help, click the stuck button in your email or at mention us in the notes of this task.